Hello everyone and welcome back to Lawrence Plays for some more Manhunt Checkpoint. And today, what are we doing? We're doing a, um, a sine wave circle of doom run. <laughs> so it's, it, there are, basically the, we have the, the, the circle of doom has lots of different ways it can be um, run. And sometimes, and some, and there's various different ways that may, that will um, allow you to sort of, to attach the circle to, uh, to, to, to the way, the different ways the circle is attached to me. So there's there's the bouncy ball one where it sort of bounces off me and carries on and um, and uh, whenever it gets whenever I get to the edge of it, there's the um, the elastic band where it sort of follows me around but on a bit of a on a bit of a spring, and then there's this one where it um it will oscillate back and forth centered on where I am, but moving at about a sort of a driving a fast driving speed. So in theory, as I just drive around. I'll be able to. It won't be obvious whether it's whether it's my movement or whether it's the circle's movement under the um, under the sine wave thing. So the hunters have a bit of an idea of where I am, but not too much precision. So I need to get over to. Is that Chinese monument? It's about that sort of direction. And I have. So I spawn in. Yes, it's Chinese monument. I spawn in in a bright pink uh, Voltic, and I've now replaced it no with a um, with a bright green Voltic. I happen to find at the side of the road. Um, so the theory is, is that the hunters won't expect me to be in this, and but it'll also be more than fast enough to get away from them if they do spot me. So, however, on the flip side, I also can't take checkpoints in this car. Because it's it, because it's a supercar, and the uh, the rules basically say that you can't take them in in in, in supercars. So so I'm not going to because that'd be cheating, um, and also because the game won't let me. So he's in a bit a little bit from column A, a little bit from column B. <laughs> what I am quite tempted to do is try and get over there and then take it on foot. So if I take this car over there, then I know that I can get away from them if they spot me without too much difficulty. Um, but I can then try and actually just grab the checkpoints on foot, walk back to this car, and hopefully be subtle enough that they Over don't here. spot hey. me. Here comes purple. Jeez. I think that would have been fatal, so I'm going to play dead. I am not going to do that with this car, then. Um, because... <laughs> It's not only has it been spotted and is therefore obvious, obvious and recognisable, it's also been kind of trashed. However, if I take this, if I just use this to get down there, and it's still quick, so as long as I get down there without being seen again... Oh, there's Pete. Did he notice me? There's Tristan as well. I'm in a very bad place here. If he sees this car, he's going to recognise it. Holy mother of God. A bit more shooting going on, okay. Let's get down in here. This car park, this seems like a good place to park. Oh, it's a car park, of course it's a good place to park. So I can leave the car here. Right. Okay, now I'm going to try and head over there on foot and see if I can get that checkpoint without being spotted and shotted. This is always an extremely dodgy way to do these sort of things. Uh, I don't see any hunters that way. I don't see any hunters that way. So I'm going to run across the road and go through here. I can hear... Okay. I heard a car behind me. I didn't like to... Um, I didn't know. I, I don't know what I would wanted to do or didn't want to do. Is there a way to get? Is there the question? The important question is: Is there a way for me to get there off road? And is there a way for me to get back on road, or on pavement at least, without looking really suspicious? And I can hear lots of cars revving and making big engine noises all over the place, which alarms me. Let's try and get down here. I can at least hide in this corner. I hear smashing noises. That must mean there's a hunter nearby. It must do. Is that... Is that... That's not Pete. Okay, let's... Is there a pavement here? There is. Good. Okay, so I can... 
walk down here now, trying to look innocent. Oh, this is so terrifying. This is absolutely terrifying because we've got. I can see two of the hunters down there. This is. Uh, I'd forgotten how stressful doing this is. Don't do that. Oh, I must have lent on the um, controller in some weird way. Um, yeah. So there, there's a hunter slap bang in the middle of the checkpoint there, which is terrifying all by itself. There's goodness knows what going on all around here. Okay, so that's the checkpoint taken. There are lots of hunters over there having some sort of fight. I don't know. I don't want to look too closely because if I look, then I won't be walking like, a, like an AI. Don't do that. Oh. Let's just flat out run and pretend I'm a scared AI. That's probably the best. Yeah, because there's an another guy running over here, so I think this is probably reasonable. And across the road, I don't think I don't know if AIs do that when they're panicking, and hopefully the um, the other players don't know if AIs do that when they're panicking either. Now if I go back in here, I can get back in that Voltic. <laughs> and now I have the ludicrously ludicrously fast car to get me to the next checkpoint. But let's check where that is first. Okay, that's up at golf course. Oops. I don't think I can take... Ooh. Unless I play around in those alleyways. I don't think I can do that on... On foot. But let's try it. And this... I know using this car... I'm basically guaranteed... I'm basically safe from the hunters when I'm in it. I mean, yeah, sure, there's a... There's a chance they could sort of smash into me and push me around and get me stuck on things. But basically, I've got enough speed in this car to hopefully just be able to get away from them, whatever, almost no matter what. There's the checkpoint. Okay, it's quite a bit further away than I thought it was. But that's not really a problem. If I do this... And then disappear up here. This is an absolute no-subtlety run. car there then oh no I need to go up I need to go up this can I get into this whatever this thing with the five on it is I can excellent if I oop, fall into the tennis courts okay so there's no way they're gonna find me in here Ooh, where does this go oh nice if I, I reckon the other side of this tennis court is probably Going to just about be close enough, or not quite close enough? Let's find out. Was that that was not close enough? Oh, I'm just outside, just outside the checkpoint. That's tragic. <laughs> oh, now the hunters know I'm close around here. You can he you can hear them driving all over the place, just trying to trying to get me. So I need to be. In fact, one of them is parked in the checkpoint, repairing his car. Oh, this is... Is he coming down here? Don't come down here. Don't come down here, don't you dare. Hide behind the tree, hide behind the tree. Oh, there are pedestrians on there! Excellent, that might... make it possible for me to get this without... Looking too suspicious. There's no hunters around. Good. How close to this do I have to be in order to get it? What I'm going to do is grab it and then sprint down that alleyway again. Can I get it from here? No. I'm not quite close enough. How close do I have to be? There we go. And if I run this way, I can get back to my Voltic again. There's the explosion to tell them I've just taken it. Oh, the Voltic's further than I realised. Oh, I should have brought it a bit further up. 
here's the tennis court that I went into first. Here's my Voltic. I'm so glad it hasn't despawned. <laughs> now let's get out of here. Oh, this is working so well. I have to admit, I've been wanting to do do a run like this for ages, using a um, a sport, using a fast car to get between the um, between the checkpoints, and then sneaking them on foot. This is fun. I don't I don't know how much longer I'm going to be able to get away with it for, because they're going to get very suspicious. They're going to see how fast I'm moving between them, and they're going to think supercar. And then I'm going to then they're going to see me going very, very slowly. Um, and they're going to think on foot. So, I don't know how long this is going to last for as a as a valid tactic. Also, this is a long way to this next checkpoint. Where, oh, it's, oh, it's here. Let's just drive straight through it for um, style and panache and to scout it out a little bit. Are there pedestrians around here? Not really. Okay. In that case, I'm going to think about getting a different car for this bit. This one. I think I've done. I've done that trick with the on foot twice in a row now. I can't tell what that is, but I'm going to grab it anyway. Oh no! I'm not allowed to use these. We had a. What the hell. <laughs> I am allowed to use. Yeah, we had a brief discussion about it earlier. Those um, those Citroens. Um, are <laughs> Pete missed me uh, stealing this car. Excellent. Because I don't want to get in a chase in this car. It's not good enough. Not by a long shot. Um, yeah, so we had a discussion about those Citroen vehicles. They're technically a sports classic, which means the game will let me use them. However, we did a little bit of a little bit of testing and decided that actually they're um, they're a bit too quick. Now I'm going to do the trick where I take the checkpoint and then before I drive through it and then just sit here innocently um, and then turn right like this and actually run away because the hunters were further away than I thought they were. Um, so I'm just going to keep going like this actually because my, pl <laughs> my plan there was to um, was to take the checkpoint, the hunters will all swarm and they go, there's nobody here or they, they go after other cars that were leaving because normally common sense says you take a checkpoint as you leave it, not as you enter it um, because then you have the best, the most time to, to try and run away and just escape um, so sometimes if I do the opposite, it's a bit unexpected, it can get me a bit of a a moment or two to, uh, to damn it, it, it can, if, if I do something unexpected, it makes it gives the hunters a sort of a, a thought, a, a sort of short circuit. So, what am I trying to say? I'm trying to say that if I do the unexpected, then they're not expecting it. So sometimes it can get, I can get away with it when I otherwise wouldn't. Jeez, that was, was that so difficult to say? <laughs> it's also fairly obvious, but it's one that it's one of the things that I don't normally do. Normally, I'll take a checkpoint as I leave it to give me a little bit of a head start on them because it, it's they get, I get five seconds grace period before the. Um, before the hunters get notified that I've taken a checkpoint. So if I can use that to get a short distance away, on the one hand, it means I'm a short distance away before they start really searching for me. But on the other hand, they've learnt that they need to be suspicious of any cars that are herring away from the checkpoint when, it's, uh, when it gets taken, or heading away from the checkpoint when it gets taken. So if I take it as I get to it and I'm a sat at a red light, then they'll hopefully be suspicious of different cars because I'll still be at the checkpoint, and what kind of idiot stays at the checkpoint after they've just taken it? How well that works? Well, who knows? Jesus. Oh, there's Mike. Is he going to see it's an oracle and get suspicious? He's doing the just sitting. He was just sitting there. I can't. I can't. I can't have that. Because if he just if he if he's sitting there and blocking me, and he just stays there and he thinks it's me because perhaps he's recognised me. I don't know. I don't think they've seen me yet, but they might have done. Um, if he's suspicious enough of me, perhaps because of the location of the circle and it's not moving fast enough, then 
he can call in reinforcements, they can block me in, and then I'm in real trouble. Whereas, if there's only one of them there, hope I, I've got a reasonable chance of getting away. So, that's the dilemma. It's, when do I, when do I run? He got out of the car, I felt I had to do something, because at that point, he can try shooting at me, and... If I'm still if I'm sitting still and I'm an absolute sitting duck, he can he can very quickly shoot me in the head, and that's game over. Now, has he identified my car? There's a there's a running joke about Mike not being able to identify an oracle, but at this point, I think there's a reasonable chance he might know what it is. At the very least, he's going to say it's a dark grey sedan. So I probably should change cars. That said. I think the next checkpoint is just over here. Yes. So I might be able to grab that and then just. This is a good enough car that I might be able to run away. There's another car there to distract Tristan. going in here, because this is an out of the way. Hopefully he hasn't noticed me sort of thing. Depends how closely he was watching. <laughs> I can feel the uh, controller vibrating because I'm on a... Um, on cobbles. Ow. Don't do that. Okay. This is going really, really well. I'm... I don't want to say anything because I'll probably jinx it, but that, I think, was the fourth checkpoint. And I've not actually been chased yet. Ooh. And I'm in almost exactly the right place to take the fifth one. I'm, I'm, I'm not in the right place because I'm underneath it because I'm in the tunnel. Uh, fifth, yeah, fifth and final one. So I need to get up top, get to that checkpoint, grab it, and then get out of here. I think it's been so long since I've actually got to this point in the game. But I think the way games end at the moment, assuming the prey actually has a chance, manages to, to get to the point of winning, is that I take the checkpoint and then I have to get a certain distance away from the hunters. If I can do that... Am I going the wrong way along this road? No, I'm not. Okay, that's that checkpoint taken. Ooh, let's go this way. <laughs> oh, I shouldn't have run that red light. I really shouldn't. Yeah, so we've got final hunt mode now, which is where the hunters have have to they basically they have to try and catch me and I was gonna say they have to try and catch me and kill me. That's that's been the case the whole the entire game. Um, the difference is now they have to um oh, fail. They have to um catch me and kill me before I get away from them. And, oh, Pete's turned his lights off as well. Alright, let's do that. And getting away from them is decide, defined as a certain distance. So, if I can get to the point where there's no hunters within however many miles of me it is, it's, it's, I think it's I think it's a thousand metres or something like that. Um, which is obviously less than a mile. Um, I don't I don't know what the exact num what the, the numbers are, but Basically, I have to get to the point where there's no way the hunters could still claim to be in a chase with me. And if I can do that, then I win the game. Uh, this is going pretty well so far. I've got a dark car, it's quite quick, and it's... I was going to say the weather is dark. Um, it's its late... Oh, I thought that was Tristan for a moment, but no, it's just a parked car. Um, um, yeah, so I need to get a certain distance away from them. So I'm going to just find one of the nice roads out north and put my foot down. I, I could take that to Infernus, that would make it a bit quicker, but I think I'd rather not get out of this car because it's done me well, and I don't, so I don't want to change it. I just want to get over to that road over there that you can just see at the top of the, uh, the mini-map and absolutely put my foot down and get out of... get out of Los Santos. Uh, like this and hopefully that'll get me the appropriate amount of distance um, the fact that 
the final Hunters in Progress has disappeared from my screen is a little bit of a concern. It's making me wonder if the game is um, working. I think if I get... Oh, that might have been Mike. It was definitely an orange car, and he had his lights off. I don't think he saw me. He went off on a side road, so maybe I'm okay. I'm just going to keep my foot down and carry on heading out of the city. We'll call this sort of the um, escape into the countryside. I've got, I've managed all of the, um, I've managed all of my objectives. I've managed to com commit all of the heists that I was trying to do. Now I need to escape the city and leave. That can be sort of the um, the, the, the plot elements for this, should we say. <laughs> now, there's no, pretty clearly nobody behind me. I think I'm pretty sure I've lost them. But the game, I mean, I, I'm pretty sure I lost them back when I managed to get away from Pete with a few few swift turns in the, in the lower hills area. Um, but it hasn't said anything yet, so I'll carry on a little bit further and then I'll go and give them a prod and see if the game, see if they, we reckon the game mode has failed. Because it's been, oh, it's been so long since I've actually won one of these that we haven't really tested the, um, the win conditions in the game mode very thoroughly, which is a bit tragic from my point of view. But, oh, it's, um, yeah... I was going to say it's either it's, it's either because it's a difficult game or because I'm not very good at it. I don't know. One way or another, I I think this counts as escaped. I'm going to call it a game here. I think I'm going to I'm going to say that I've won. Um, you'll see. Well, well, I'll come back in a second if, if it's decided that I haven't. But uh, so yes, thank you for watching the uh, watching the game. Um, nice to have won one once again. And um, yeah, I hope you've enjoyed it. There'll be a hunt of you, so you'll be able to see. How, how they reacted to my uh, shenanigans and whatnot. Um, and then, uh, there'll be, of course, there'll be more of these videos in the, in the weeks to come. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Oh, there's a lot of cars up there. Oh, someone abandoned that car. Is that... Oh, he's a gang member or something. Well, was a gang member. Got a car here. Yeah, that one. It looks kind of sus, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's that's extra sus. Boxing, boxing, boxing. No, he died. No, I didn't. Huh. Oh, uh, there's that white SUV running away. Or he's leaving. There are many chaos of things happening around this part of the world. Yeah, it wasn't him. I've got a car here exiting a petrol station, which I just lagged through. That's not uncommon for you, Mike, let's be honest. Also true. <laughs> uh, he's, he's, turning to, he's turning towards the checkpoint. Is that red one just by... Her pink is. Yep. Reversing and everything. No, it's the little old lady. Check what's going on. Taking up. This this white one, Mike. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm gonna be a bike for that. That's not him. Okay. Good to know. Ah, he bamboozled us.
this white car here? Yep. Is this possible it's... now? <laughs> Voice line. No, he's coming from the north. Uh, not the north, the um, top of the map. Um, yeah, the north. He seems no, it, it, to ignore me, it's not him. It's not him. Is that you sitting there in the road, Tristan? Yeah. Uh, he's taking he's it. Taken it. Okay. Um, I see a yellow F40 type of car. Is that? This is probably it. Which way? Um, heading towards that'll be east. Okay. Towards the checkpoint. Fine. According to the radar, is directly behind you. I'm going to a car moving at speed with its headlights off, heading north. I can see a yellow car again. I was going to say, where, whereabouts was it? Uh, it was heading towards shopping centre. Or in that generic area, like... Uh, I was heading was... that way, but my lights are on. Uh, I yeah. was, my lights are smashed, so it might have been me. It, oh, it might have been Pete, yeah, okay. Whatever it is... He's a long way east. This circle is moving very fast. He's probably on the highway. Uh, I am down by uh, Mirror Park. He's taken it. No. no yes, yes, he has. Just has. That guy's dead. Yep. He must have taken that whilst I was sat in there repairing. Sneaky bastard. Yeah, be that. He would be very yeah, happy about that. <laughs> I'm on the highway now, heading north. Jesus. There's a reasonable number of cars on the bridge going from, from Mirror Park. Um, oh, I see so I'm right by that. I'm I've just been, I got out of my car and just got instantly run over by a vehicle. From Casino, so that's, 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 that's him. Uh, dark car, white male, uh, don't know much about it. Heading due west along the main road from Casino. He did run me over when I got the car, so I've only just been able to sort of get I back in the turn round. I just won't turn left there. Did you see what sort of car it was? No. Uh, I'm going to slide it up coupe. Right, I'm heading down west to down Boulevard. I think he turned south. Ambiguous. Yep. Uh, and the, with the dark and you know, headlights and so on, sometimes you get unsure about things like skin colours. Weirdly, they had orange skin. Well, how, how, many, ta how many times has it been a question of how, how can we take it? The heck? Got a car going the wrong way onto the highway here, but he may be scared from the gunshots. Yeah, the, I, yeah. That, that's me. Oops, sorry. 
to it. Like. <laughs> Just take heading north. Just turn right. Stay Ahead of me, yeah. Him. Got him. He had to do that on foot. Pass Bahama Bamas, no, 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 that's, no. that's him. Yeah, got him past Bahama Bamas. Heading uh, west. No, east, sorry. At very high speed, he's losing me. Mm -hmm. uh, heading. Oh, where are we going? I don't even know where we're going, to be fair. We are currently one south of Life Invader heading east. Um, five ways? Yes. I think. Is that five ways? Yes. Yes, yeah, shopping cool. centre. Yeah, we're at the south side of shopping centre going up north. Uh, there's a chance to find a Windsor in front of me. Uh, not sure I'm going to be able to keep up with him. Still heading north oh, towards uh, hills. He's taking a left. Circle is irrelevant now. FYI. Okay. He's heading oh, west. Okay. I've lost him. He's pulled ahead. Still heading west, was, but right in the distance. What was he in? Um, like a dark coloured generic sedan. Which road are you... is he heading west on? Uh, uh, by golf course. He's probably turned by now. I lost complete sight of him. He may have just wins this one. Yeah. Uh, where's the final checkpoint? He's taken it. That was it. <clears throat> he then has to yep, uh, get away from all of us. Yeah. For 20 seconds.